What's going on guys? Danny with Lanier Lawn Care and today I'm sure a lot of you have noticed the positivity YouTube challenge uh, in the community going around and I have been nominated by Ben and KH at Acme Mowing so uh, here is my response. Alright guys so a lot of you probably uh, have some of you have followed me since the beginning of my YouTube start uh, about well three years ago three and a half um, and some of you have just started following me recently so um, let's go back to the beginning and let you know how I pretty much started all of this so um, I was working a good job, I was making decent money, and I decided that I didn't want to be just another number to somebody. So uh, I decided to pretty much branch off and uh, I did a, a thing of lawn care for part time just to see what kind of money could be made in my area and things like that before I just up and quit a job. and. Uh, you know didn't have any income coming in so I started doing that and then it turned into what do I do now like how do I start how do I you know I mean there's LLC there's so proprietorship there's there's all these different things how do I do taxes um, and so I was watching YouTube videos uh, before I before I started my company I was watching Blake at B&B Andy at Cut and Clean um, and uh, you know amongst other people it, it came down to uh, you know Blake I was watching him mow to learn how to stripe lawns uh, I didn't know he was so close to my area at the time and and I was like okay well if I'm gonna do this I'm gonna do it right I want to get a good mower so I contacted Blake and uh, needless to say he answered the phone couldn't believe it um, he answered the phone and we talked for probably an hour over mowers and and what he thought of his and and everything else and so uh, so that's how my business got started was literally by YouTube and uh, so Andy was doing the YouTube thing he had already he was already up to uh, around 1500 subscribers at the time um, and so he told me he said look you should you should jump into this YouTube scene and let people know the mistakes that you make along the way as you're growing. And I was like, well, that's kind of cool, you know? Yeah, let's let's do that. Uh, and I didn't know it would be something that I was so interested in at the time, or something that got to where you know I am today. And so I started doing the YouTube thing, and uh, you know, thanks to Andy once again, and uh, it, it just took off and I've had people contact me just like other people and say hey man you know I've reached out to several people you're the only person that's replied to me and and things like that or or you know hey I started my, my company because of you or they're asking questions about how they do different things you know YouTube is a huge community and you can just pretty much find anything on YouTube that you want to know about all you got to do is search for it and it's probably on YouTube and somebody's already did it or went over how to do it and it's it's a huge help um, you know the one thing that that I wish I did sooner in my business was was have an accountant and uh, I mean it I, I thought that it was gonna be outrageous and it just scared me away it scared me away and uh, you know once I found out that how cheap it actually was I was like man this is totally worth it you know there's so much positivity on YouTube that you can find out anything and just about everything you want to know YouTube is what got my business started YouTube is what got me personally where I'm at today anything I want to know that I don't know and I want to you know check out I just go to YouTube and I YouTube everything I review the crap out of things but uh, you know amongst that it's all the friendships you know going to GIE and, and being around all of those people I'm just a normal guy I'm no better than anybody else if it wasn't for my you know subscriber base or my my fans that watch my channel I wouldn't be where I'm at today and uh, I don't take credit for that you know I mean it's it's all it's all you that put me where I'm at 
and I'm still look at myself as I'm no better than anybody else. When I get emails or phone calls, you know, sometimes I don't answer the phone because I don't know the number. Uh, people leave me messages. You know, I, I usually call them back. Um, emails normally reply to all the emails or uh, you know Facebook Messenger, Instagram, things like that. But um, you know, YouTube has been so so strong. I guess you could say. Uh, for me, it's it's been there regardless because you know years ago you couldn't do this and uh, YouTube has become a platform that is just blowing up and people realize that and so now you know more people are jumping on the the YouTube train and and doing their own thing and there's a lot of great information out there you couldn't even think to name all these people that have great information of how to do things um, you know and and it's like <clears throat> how do I how do I what weed is this how do I get rid of this you know I mean there's so many videos and so much knowledge out there that I don't pay for nothing like all I got to do is go to YouTube and type it in and then boom there it is and guys let me tell you the friendships that I've gained from from a lot of y'all the people that I talk to uh, whether it's one time a week or whether it's one time a month we still get along. You'll see. You'll see some of us jumping on forums, and we'll be going back and forth about a product or something. Don't mean anything when we get together and we see each other at GIE or whatever. We're all all good. I mean, the community is so great that you can literally walk past somebody that's got fifty thousand subscribers or or stand that's got over four hundred thousand and they literally talk to you like they're a human. Um, you know, I mean, they're they're great, absolute great people. Keith Kaffis is another one. I thought when I met these people, I was like, yeah, they're not going to talk to me at all. And, uh, you know, it, to my surprise, me and Stan, when we're at different places, we hang out a lot of the times. And uh, it, it's amazing because he he's human just like we are and uh so you know the the whole youtube community being positive to each other is just totally great guys like um i, I really don't know what else to say about this i mean there's so much out there to gain knowledge wise friendship wise uh we've went and, and spent a weekend with ben at acme and you know i mean we've we've went to tennessee and uh i've met family and and met up with people down there and it's just totally awesome to see everybody that supports ben i thank you for nominating me for this challenge because you know if it wasn't for for the youtube community if it wasn't for youtube period then i wouldn't be where i'm at in my business today and i wouldn't have the friends and the relationships that i have with my audience and with other youtubers so i find it absolutely great i love talking to people i love meeting new people so so that was a thing for me I didn't know how to take it in the beginning or you know of how to do it and all that came in time so uh, here we are now you know to all the people I've made friends with um, whether it's people that follow me or people that uh, you know I've met through doing YouTube um, other youtubers people at GIE I mean just about anybody guys thank you thank you for being there thank you for the support thank you for all the positivity that you've given me because if it wasn't for y'all and if it wasn't for youtube then i wouldn't be where i'm at today you are the people that literally keep me striving to continue to make videos and continue to to do you know giveaways and and produce uh good content for y'all so i appreciate that uh once again ben KH, thanks for the nomination. I appreciate it. Uh, I guess I need to nominate three people for this challenge. Um, it's been very rough. It's been very hard to to try to pick three people, but uh, I have come to the conclusion of my three people. 
So I'm going to put their links down below and uh, so you can check them out. You can go over there. You can yell at them and tell them that uh, they have been nominated to do this challenge. So uh, my first pick, this guy has been there for me and we've talked uh, quite a bit. Um, not recently, but things have been hectic. I'm sure Tony at Tony's Lawn Care, uh, you were nominated, sir. So uh, if you would, it would be an honor to have you do this challenge. Um, second, I'm going to nominate Derek at Southern Style Lawn Care. Derek, you've always been there for me. We've all, uh, you know, we've we've talked back and forth about different things. Um, you've asked me questions. I've asked you questions. It's been a true pleasure uh, getting to talk to you and and being, you know, a, a friend. So, uh, Derek at Southern Style, if you would accept this challenge, that would be great. And the third person I would like to nominate is Nick and Sierra at One Love Lawn. So uh, I know y'all are watching. I know you're going to enter the room and the party's going to get started. And uh, so that's going to be my three nominations that I would like to nominate would be Tony at Tony's Lawn Care, Derek with Southern Style, and uh, Nick and Sierra Saint with One Love Lawn. So thanks for watching, guys. Once again, thank you, YouTube community, for all the positive feedback you give me, and hopefully I am returning the positivity to y'all. So thank you, and have a great weekend.